Let's see how we can easily make the double exposure effect in DaVinci Resolve. Add your clip to the timeline and place it where you want your double exposure to be. Before we start we need to thank our sponsors. Today's video is sponsored by Ferrari, Dolce Cabana, and the Krusty Krab. Go to the color page and draw a mask around your subject. Add a bit of softening to the mask. Add an alpha output and connect the blue dot. In the edit page drag a background clip and place it in top of your current clip. In the composite panel set the composite mode to foreground. Select the first clip, go to the composite panel and set the composite mode to alpha. Drag the second clip around and place it where you think looks better. Our double exposure still looks terrible. Duplicate your first clip and place it on the top of the others. Play around with the composite mode and opacity to find what works in your case. When you are done, select all of your clips and move them up in the timeline. Drag and drop a solid color in the bottom and change the color to white. Now let's move our three clips up again and place a background clip in below. Experiment with the composite mode and opacity until you are satisfied with your results. Repeat the same thing again to place another background clip and blend it with the one we have. Add an adjustment layer on top of the clips and add the film damage effect. Place the settings to your taste, and add another adjustment layer on top. Add a film grain effect. Move both of the adjustment layer up and place another one below them. Add a lens reflections effect, as always, experiment with the settings to find out what looks better for you. In my case I reduced the film grain and dirt, and made a bit of overall grading. Of course you can achieve this effect in the fusion page, if you want to end up with a broken computer like me. If you find this clip useful, make sure to watch my other videos also, and don't forget to subscribe, after all it's free.